Okay, just a quick video to show how I'm running a tuner app on my iPad off of the Helix. Uh, start with a USB cable plugged into the Helix, comes up to the Apple Camera Connector Kit, plugs into the iPad. There's a second cable plugged into the Apple Camera Connector Kit, and it's just a charge cable. It keeps the battery charged. Um, all right, so go into Global Settings, go to page three. First two here are uh, reamp source USB 7, reamp source USB 8. Uh, I have 7 set for guitar, 8 for set for aux. Uh, all this means is, so for the first one, guitar to USB 7, it just means whatever's coming in on the uh, guitar input jack will be, uh, the dry signal will be routed out to USB 7. Uh, same for this, any dry, you know, whatever comes in on aux, that dry signal goes out to 8. So this happens before any you know, path blocks or anything that's in your, your path. Uh, all right, so that's how you set up the Helix. Plug the cable in, set your reamp up to uh, whatever your input is, in my case, guitar, guitar jack. And then on the iPad, I run on song for charts. So when I get on stage, I'll load on song. Once that's loaded, I will load this Peterson iStrobosoft tuner app. All right, so once both of these are loaded, you can just take four fingers, put it down, and swipe to go between the apps. Okay, I'm swiping the wrong way. <laughs> there. So, you know, I'll be on stage playing, and if I want to tune between songs, I'll just swipe, and there's the tuner, and then just swipe back, and I'm back to my charts. Uh, all right, so put the volume up, and... I swipe this over there's the tuner and you can see that um, I haven't engaged the tuner on the helix right but it's getting that reamp signal uh, so I can tune you know I can just volume down and swipe with the four fingers and then I can tune uh, and then just swipe back and be back to my chart. Um, so that's essentially how it works. It's pretty slick. For a while, I was, if I hold tap, uh, I hold the tuner and turn the tuner on, you know, I had this output USB 1, 2, um, and I was engaging the tuner and tuning on the iPad, but uh, I was messing around with this the other day. Like I say, I set that on mute. Um, and when I, when I play the, you know, I get the tuner here, but even with the volume up and the tuner not engaged, uh, I will still get a signal going into the iPad. And apparently it's because the Peterson app is picking up audio on any USB input, uh, not just one and two. So... I thought that was pretty cool and it makes it really easy to tune quickly on stage and then to go between my charts. Uh, that's it for that. And you notice that my tap is flashing blue uh, and that's because it's actually picking up Global Clock from Onsong, which I thought was pretty cool. Uh, maybe I'll make another video to show how I set this up, but see my presets. Here, I'll push number two, come alive, and when I do that, uh, it fires to pull Come Alive up on Onsong, and because I got BPM configured in Onsong and Global Clock going out, it automatically changes the tempo for the chart that I bring up. So as I go through the songs, it automatically is pulling the charts up. It's syncing up the tempo with what I've got configured in Onsong, and if I ever need to tune, I just swipe over and tune. So it makes for a pretty good setup with just one USB cable and the Apple camera connector kit. Pretty cool stuff.